One day, Fluffy the pup was walking through the meadow, and he came across Mr. Unicorn next to an apple tree. Whoa, look at all those apples. Oh, hello, Fluffy. Mr. Unicorn, how did this get here? Well, from a seed, of course. The seed went through the plant life cycle. What's the plant life cycle? Well, I'll show you. This big tree started as a tiny seed. This seed did something called germination. This is where the seed grows into a sprout with roots. What do you think the seed needed in order to germinate, Fluffy? Hmm. Does it need candy? No, it needs sunlight, water, <laughs> air, and soil. After the seed sprouts, it turns into a sapling, which is a young tree. When this sapling grows big enough, it finally flowers. Whoa, I didn't know an apple tree did that. Yes, an apple tree flowers. And then the bees come along to the blossoms and pollinate the tree. After the blossoms have been pollinated, the flowers begin to become fruit. The fruit on this apple tree here are red apples. Inside the apples are more seeds. They have the possibility of becoming trees like this one too. And this is how it works for most other plants too. Wow, thanks for telling me how the plant life cycle works, Mr. Unicorn. I'll remember this forever. You're welcome, Fluffy. Fluffy went home that day and couldn't stop thinking about everything that Mr. Unicorn had told him. He decided he would come back tomorrow to get an apple so he could grow an apple tree of his own. The end.